Hey, what's up guys? My name is Steven. I'm a tech entrepreneur, real estate investor, author, YouTuber, volunteer paramedic, and I am, well, I'm fat. I haven't always been fat. In fact, I was quite skinny back in the US Navy days. But over the years, the weight started to pack on. First it was five pounds, then it was 10, then it was 20. Well, you get the point. And now I'm 280 pounds. But like most people, I procrastinated. I kept saying, oh, I'll lose weight next week. Or maybe it's next month. Or, you know, but that next day never came. Then about a month ago, I was pulling duty as a volunteer paramedic and I was dispatched to a cardiac arrest of a young man about my age and about my size. 911, where is your emergency? This is Haley at station six. Kevin, he, he collapsed, he's not breathing. I think he had a heart attack. We're dispatching an ambulance right now. Stay on the line with me. Medic 6, respond to your station. 28-year-old male, unresponsive, cardiac arrest. Working code. Clear, analyzing. Stand back, everybody clear. Shocking. It hit me like a ton of bricks. That could have been me laying there on the ground with my fellow medics working on me. That's when I decided that I needed to do something about it and I needed to do something now. So I called up a friend of mine who has previously struggled with his own weight and asked him how he was able to drop the pounds. He agreed to come over to my house, look at my pantry, and kind of consult with me on what I should do. They're gummies. Gummies. But they're, what's wrong? They're. Do you know how much you'll gain from just a small container of this? But it was a five pound bag. <laughs> You're gonna gain from more than five pounds from just this container alone. But only five pounds, that's a lot of gummies. I, I'm willing to eat five pounds for that many gummies. <sighs> you can't have this, Steven. We okay. gotta get rid of it. Okay, this All goes right. in the no-no stash. All right. Next up in line. Steven, you've got like a fat boy assembly line sitting here. You've got flour next to the oil, next to the Tons and tons of cake and sugar. Yeah. What are you doing? Deep frying this? Maybe. Get, get all this out of here. You can have the oil, but the cakes have gotta go, but, man. But, but they're, they're, okay. They're diabetes in a box. Get rid of them. I can't, I can't even begin. <laughs> Hunks, yeah. One, one letter away from chunks. But, 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 it says healthy! Hell, just because it's labeled healthy doesn't mean that it's healthy, Stephen. But, organic. Organic? Sugar's organic. All right. More cookies. Fudge stripped shortbread. I love these. They're awesome! <laughs> you gotta get rid of them, man. They're, they're habit forming. They're delicious, I'll give you that, but they're like crap. Fine. More cakes. Here's the thing about things like these, these snacks that kind of present themselves as being, you know, good for you. They're not. And honestly, Steven, probably the biggest offender out of here, you've just got like liters of these things, man. Hold on, I can fix it. That doesn't nearly fix it enough for me. It's gotta go. Okay. Yeah, I mean, the problem with all this stuff is that it's, it's all habit forming. It's really sugary. It's kind of like crack, but give me that, Steven. Steven! Okay, honestly, I really did not have that much junk food in my pantry. Just kind of consider that a little bit of creative license for the skit. Now, for me, my real problem comes in with fast food. With my busy work schedule, fast food is, well, it's fast. My doctor tells me that I need to be closer to about 180 pounds, so I guess that means I need to lose 100 pounds. Cutting out the fast food and adding daily physical activity 
that should make the difference. Now, this is not going to be a crash starvation diet or anything crazy. No, I'm going to keep this simple and prove that a healthy lifestyle can be obtained while still living a normal life. Now, personally, I really hate running. So I'm going to skip those in my workouts. Instead, I'm going to stick to things I actually enjoy because I feel that's a requirement for keeping this up in the long term. It must be fun and something that I just don't hate doing. You can easily repeat everything that I do in my videos. I will not show any complicated workouts that only the top world athletes can actually do. No, these videos are for us, you know, the average person. Throughout the coming weeks and months, I'm going to take you step by step with me. We're going to be a team and we're going to be in this together to change our health. Now that I've shared this with you, I would like to invite you to come along with me on my journey. No, our journey to better health. Now this is going to take a lot of work from both of us. And at times, we're going to want to quit. But I know we can do this together. So whenever you are feeling down, just play another one of my videos and I'll be there to motivate you along the way. Then, as the views of my videos keep rising, that will motivate me to keep going because I know I'm not in this alone. Now is the time. It's the time for you to take action with me. But don't worry. Remember, we're in this together. I want you to pause this video and comment down below. Tell me what your current weight is and what your goal is. There's no shame. Just write it in the comment box. And now we have a goal for us to work towards. I also have a Discord server that I set up where we can build a community sharing with each other our tips and suggestions. The link to that Discord is down in the description box, and I hope to see you there. Each week, I will release a new video showing my progress, along with skits and other content that I really hope you will enjoy watching. Included in this content will be the lessons that I've learned along the way to help save you from making the same mistakes that I did. Now, when creating this show, I wanted to add a little bit of lighthearted humor, and I hope you enjoy it. Now, please understand that these are supposed to be humorous and not meant to offend anyone. Honestly, life is far too short to live without humor. So live, laugh, and enjoy the videos, and I'll see you next week. Oh, well, wait, wait, one last thing before you leave. The lawyers that I have chained up down in my basement are getting a little bit restless and want me to make the following disclaimer. The videos on this channel are for entertainment purposes only and are not medical advice or health advice. You should definitely consult with a proper medical professional before beginning any weight loss program or exercise regimen. Blah, 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 blah. You know, you get the point. Or said another way, enjoy the videos, stay safe, and don't sue me. Thanks for watching, and also thanks to my amazing friends for helping me record the skits in this video, and I'll see you next week.